Hey everyone, welcome back to some more of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So, last time we met with the Hemingrial and took this picked fortress down, uh, killed the picked chief, and it turns out Hemingrial is sick. And we're gonna talk to his son, Billy, um, who apparently wrote us the letter. That's what we thought at least up until now and now we find out that it was the Yarl who wrote us the letter and we need to pick another leader to lead the Snottingham area and I think that's gonna be the Snottinghamshire questline where we just pick a leader and see how it goes. Let's speak with Lily then. Lily, There you are! Come! Ride with me to the falls. They are Freya's gifts to these Unforgiving lands. All right, but if I don't faint at the sight of them, you've oversold the view. You fight with impressive skill, I should say. I taught you well, I think. You taught me to fight empty air, Vili, and trees and snowdrifts and the like. Oh, I am certain I saved you from a snowdrift once, and a murderous tree. That's how I remember it. Any man who would call a tree murderous is a man who has had one too many blows on the head. Who? That tower there. It recalls the broken wall in Norway on the road to my uncle. Let's look up the tower then. Start on this. Alright, let's follow Willie now. That tower there. It recalls the broken wall in Norway on the road to my uncle's. Remember? I do. I remember the bite of that winter's chill as we sheltered from the wind for hours. It was you who got us stuck there. Searching for the chickens you let loose before the Yule feast. I'll have you remember. It is good to ride with you again, Arstek. 
I told you, that was meant to be a dragon's tail. It was a woody little twig in my eyes. No dragon's tail. Must I remind you of your own disrobed adventures in the pre-dawn streets of Starbinger? Eivor the Pantless, a head soaked with mead, and many pockets full of vomit. Dragon's tail it was then. Are you sure you want my father's mead? Not afraid you might wake up tomorrow, naked, face down in a hog's pen. Is that what you call your house? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Stonebur, was Trigve not sent there by father to help? We must go! Eivor! What happened? I came too late to stop this. The Picts set fires and ran. They mean to spite us. There are more people trapped within. Free them, Eivor. Tend the wounded. We'll get them out. Coming from the well, I thought someone might have fallen in, but when I called down into the dark, nothing was further on. Please, leave me be! Not me! My wife! Save her first! I have to move fast. <clears throat> she has drawn her last breath. Eivor! Eivor, where are you? 
Get over here! to clear the path. I will get the man, Eivor. You carry the woman. Niflheim will have to wait. You are staying here today. <laughs> oh, thank to your father. Hold on to me. I can get you out. Draw breath because of you. I thought I might have to rescue you, Willy. Had I died, it would have been my time. My fate is already spun. I'm sorry, but you cannot endanger yourselves like this, lords. You have people to lead, a future to consider. The old man has wisdom, Willy. You have the full weight of this clan on your back. My father carries that weight. I do the fighting and feasting, and I am expert at both. It's good to have you watching my back again, Eivor. You see what I deal with, Eivor? The mind of a troll in the body of an Aesir. <laughs> Still the same arse stick as when we were children. I'll never change. This is hardly the time for lightness, you two. We have many injured to comfort. Well, that is your domain, Trigvi. I don't wish to be seen as a savior and healer all in one afternoon. The waters at Kinder Doomfall will soothe my wounds. My father needs me. I'll be there. Billy, stop! Eivor, wait a moment. Eminger Jarl has confided in you about his health. He has. He said Billy wasn't taking it well. Billy lives in another world entirely right now. He is cracked inside, and will not face the full truth laid before him. And how are you? Have you braced yourself for what is to come? I... I have made my peace with the future, yes. Worry yourself with the wounded here. I will talk to Billy myself. Dunstan Ingot and Billy is all the way over there. Why not?
will protect me from the pecked people. I keep trying, but... I just can't do it right. Mind and wit. Stack the cairn stones, high and wide. But they keep falling. You have to let the air and nature's beauty guide you. Shape, balance, expression are key. Oh, wow. Thank you for showing me how. Steady your hands and your heart, tiny giant. Goodbye. Billy was right. The kinder downfall is. Oh, where is he? Sunan, guide me.
nothing more to share for now. Stretch your wings, Sunan. Eivor, you found my secret hort. I would be deaf to have not heard your singing. Your crow's craggle could awaken the dead. <laughs> These skirmishes with the picks, they've worn you down. Not at all. The more scars, the better the boast. Oh, look at my father. A battle-worn veteran, carved up like a goat on a spit. Not a metaphor I'd use just now. Not in his state. These waters are magnificent, no? They comfort and heal. They are Freya's gift to man. Billy, you need to face it. Your father is dying. When he departs for the corpse hall, you will take his place, as expected. The novelty of this soggy north has worn on me, Eivor. Too warm for winter living, too cold for summer. I've heard Mercia is more temperate. Dense forests, bright colors, thriving streams. Is that how it is in your settlement? You are to be Jarl, Vili. Your father expects it. The people of Snottinghamshire expect it. I only want sun on my skin and an axe in my hand. Ale and adventure. Not the staid life of a Jarl. You defy a long tradition, Vili. The son takes after his father. That is the way of things. Eivor. I have my own reasons to see you made Jarl. The Raven Clan wants friends in England. You are among my very best. You do not need me in that scene to secure an alliance. You and Sigurd are beloved here. Your father is dying, Billy. Now is the time to get your house in order. It is not my house. It is the clan's house, and the clan will decide what happens next. You have a chance to end on good terms with your father. I wasn't afforded the same luxury. Don't squander it. Billy! Billy! Come forth! Another attack? It's your father! He hasn't got long! Come to the longhouse! Him and Arjal is at the edge of death. I must see him before he goes. This long house, the Sudan. The Sudan. I hoped I would find you here. You seem well. Your wounds have healed quickly. I heard my father talking to the others. 
he said you were his child now, so... So that makes me your brother. You are welcome to this family. Now we will grow together and feast together and scamper over the snows together. I hope that pleases you. It pleases me. What is it you are building now? Two homes or a hill in the mountain? This is my father, Varen. And this is Shopvid, the cruel. Uh. Ah!
Holy moly. Alright. Might as well do that. Did you hear what happened to Archibald? Aye, the drunken fool. I was there when he lit the thing on fire. We all told him not to, but he did tempt fate. You saw it all. Go on, tell us what happened. <laughs> I miss Wilfred. That's Rue. A legendary picked warrior who can rip a wolf apart with his bare hands. You saw him? I don't know what we saw. Not exactly. But there's something up there. Archibald held up his torch all brave like after lighting the fire. No the next thing we knew, his head dropped to his feet. We ran. Should we at least fetch his body? Huh. You can. I won't go back up that cursed mountain for all the silver in this land. Finally, dear Recivly, my friends, I have found the where the Great Pick Legend resides. We just need to follow the trail of trophies atop the Kindler Downfall. There really was someone killing the bears in the forest, leaving a grand bloody trail. He's not a myth, only he could have done this. Once we hunt him down, the Great Archibald will be famous throughout Hemtop and we will be rid of this life of poverty. Cast about this land, my friend. Do you see soon? Survey the area soon. Did you hear what happened to Archibald? Aye, the drunken fool. I was there when he lit the thing on fire. We all told him not to, but he did tempt fate. You saw it all. Go on, tell us what happened. I miss Wilfred. That's Rue. A legendary picked warrior who can rip a wolf apart with his bare hands. You saw him? I don't know. 
Sunan, guide me. I don't know what we saw. Not exactly. But there's something up there. Archibald held up his torch all brave like after lighting the fire. The next thing we know, his head dropped to his feet. He ran. Speak your name, warrior. Have it your way. Your life's purpose was to die for... So, he speaks. Traveler, what seek you? Perhaps I can help. Well worth a little silver, I assure you. Yes, all right. Now, show me your map. There is a place... here. it back faster than me, you are the victor. How much silver are you willing to part with? The hoard it is! Man your horn! Thor himself oh, yeah. couldn't outbring me. Could you just start south of the market? A day in the 
this. Will Hemingarial go to heaven, Mother? I... I hope he will. If he has accepted Christ into his heart, the Lord will most certainly receive him. What a perfect figure you have. Poised, powerful, perfect. Me! Mm, yes. I cannot help but wonder, is your flighting as striking as you? How do you mean? I draw smiles from the women and winks from the men. I'm a poetry lover who's skilled with his pen. If you fancy a round, then approach and come speak. If you're lustful for verse, then I've got what you seek. I'll flight with you. Perfect. Would you like to make it uh, interesting? With a wager, I mean. My wager. Thank you. Are we ready? Let's begin. What know you of the power of fleets to seduce? Are you even aware that they have such a use? See, your weapon lies not in your belt, but your head. With words, I'll ensnare you and put you to bed. Yes! I could feel when you entered, the room became warm. Though I doubted your flighting, I quite liked your form. On your every word, I can say that I'm hung. By your words, good sir, I am far from stung. Not very good. I could fleet more sweet nothings inside of your ear. Though I warn you, they're some of the lewdest you'll hear. But instead of just telling, I'll happily show. While I doubt you can take me, I'll give you a go. That was delicious. It's rare that I meet one who can keep pace with me. So, uh, what do you say? Shall we find somewhere and exchange a little more than, uh, words? It was only a flight. My winnings, please. Yes, of course. I was only... It was just a game, yes? 
friendly banter? It's been a true pleasure. To see you both together again like this, it recalls days long past, makes me feel young again. Hold on to that feeling, and take it with you to the Hall of the Slain. You have become a great warrior, Eivor. A warrior and a leader. Worth, worth song and verse. I had many good teachers, Hemingayal. You, chief among them. I beg of you now. Do not... Let my lessons die. Pass them on. The seer is on her way, father. She has remedies for you. Cures and charms. I held you here, really. In one proud hand when you were fresh from your mother's womb. I watched you grow. Dirty haired boy, swinging sticks and running through the mud, dreaming of glory. I, I am proud of what you have become, son. <laughs> of what you will become, no matter I, uh, I, uh, 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 sheesh. Father, Vili. Must prepare for the funeral. I'll send for my clan. You call on the nobles of the Shire. The nobles have begun to arrive. Trigve needs our help to see this through. We will be at the funeral pyre, overlooking the village.
Show me what lies ahead. A worthy pyre for him in her yard. His journey to the halls will be heralded by roaring flames. Eivor. Drengur. Suniva, thank you for coming. The sight of old friends lets my heart rest easy. We came as soon as we heard, bearing gifts for Hemingur Yab. The celebration will last many days. How soon shall we begin? The pyre's construction is underway, and all of our guests are lodged and welcomed. We could begin shortly. Good. You handled this well, Trigve. I pledged my life's oath to Hemingur Yab. There is nothing I would not do for him. The all thing must be held when the week is out and the funeral is done. The nobles of this shire will name Vili the Jarl of our clan. This assumes they will be sober after a week of drinking and weeping. It will be a grand funeral. Father will have a clear view of his lands from here. The flames will burn bright and tall for all the shire to see. You've done well. This was his favorite spot in the Shire. I suppose we should get started. Our guests need looking after. I will look for you later, to save you from them, once the mead has really soaked in. You are a true gift, Eivor. Thank you. Trigvi is Hemthoth's rock. With him around, the city can keep its peace. He's a good man. I must be away for a short time, Eivor. I want to retrieve something for my father. A gift. When did you have time to make a funeral gift? <laughs> it was something I had hoped to give him in life. You must see it to believe it. I brought a gift from the Raven Clan. I stored it at the watchtower on the far side of Hemthorpe. Very kind, thank you. I should like to see. I should look over the gift first. It must be worthy of Heming Ayal. There's a heaviness to your look, Eivor. What troubles you? Himminger desired my counsel before he died. Wanted my opinion on the future of this clan's leadership. That would be Vili, would it not? If tradition held, yes. Trikvi has tasked me to help the Volva with the sacrifices. Could we speak with her to ease your thoughts? It is a good idea, but let me go alone. Set scouts around the village. The people here must mourn in safety. On borrowed time. Right, unfortunately guys, this will be ending the video. In the next one, I'm going to continue my journey of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And we're going to see what else the game has in store for us. With that said, I will see you in the next one. Bye.